hello everyone so in this video we are going to see about one of our national instruments driver okay so far we can see a lot of uh, videos regarding this space okay so coming here we'll be seeing uh, NI support driver okay what is DAC MX okay what is DAC MX you can go to this link Okay, you can go to this link support downloads drivers and you can find the important driver ni dac mx so where will we use this driver okay why we need this driver okay so as you all know ni has a pxi or mxi chassis chassis and it has some uh, io cards installed in it or it or uh, some communication cards installed in it so how a host pc is connected to that chassis through some cable right through some cable it is connected to the chassis so like uh, we need some driver to interact uh, host pc with the chassis chassis in sense where the card is installed in it right so we require this important driver dac mx so dac mx provides support for customers using ni data acquisition and signal conditioning devices this is very important to acquire data and to condition the signals okay so it's an instrument driver so it's an instrument driver that controls every aspect of our DAC system including signal conditioning the most important point is data acquisition and signal conditioning so from configuration to programming in lab view to low level OS and device control okay for device control and to pay, and in order to make any program changes in the lab view environment uh, in real time we need this DAC MX so you can build your applications with measurement specific functions data types and analysis integrations and reliably make faster measurements with optimized data transfer direct memory access DMA direct memory access controller data transfer and single point IO so so we need to install this DAC Max driver before speaking with any software okay so we have an options for Windows here okay we have an option for Windows here the version latest version available is 20.1 and it supports both 32 bit and 64 bit applications okay so the languages are available here are English French German Japanese Korean and Chinese so this is the area where you can download it okay the file size is 5.89 MB so you have to download it in the host PC um, and and install it okay then you then you should connect your uh, cable with the chassis so this is where you can find this driver okay thanks for watching